All right, y'all, welcome back to the show. We got a special interview right here. We in LA with it. Real quick, you want to introduce yourself to the people? Man, it's the kid, baby boy. Scared to kill, you scared to rock, go get a job. Bully game, we got that name, because we been leaving niggas scarred. We like the youngest niggas stepping, who really fucking with the mob. Don't back and forth for niggas, they know what I stand for. And you say you a killer, what the fuck you ran for? And this glass so fucking big, I can't even hold my pants up. You feel me? Yeah, I know what it is. All right, where'd you, how far did you come for, for this LA event? Where'd you come from? So I came all the way from Jacksonville, Florida. Yeah. You got it, been in LA, you feel me? Uh, yeah. So, so you've been in LA this whole time? This whole week? I've been weekend? in LA, I've been, I really, I really posted me here like four or five days ago, but I just got here yesterday, and I came late. All right. So I got here now. Yeah, well, so what's the biggest difference you would say coming from Florida all the way to California? Like the cultural differences, what do you notice? Um, what I notice? Like, like, give me an example. Like, you know how they, a good example is they be talking different. Like, out here they be saying, like, on the dead homies and shit. They be yeah. saying hella, like, different slang words. Oh, in yeah, Florida yeah. they be saying jit and shit. Y'all like, slang, y'all slang yeah. different. And y'all heavy, y'all, y'all slang way different than I. Yeah, I slang out there. Yeah, alright. But each uh, part of Florida got different, like, some parts uh, of Florida got different slang. Like, our, our slang different from Miami slang. Uh, so, you feel me? Like, that's how it be. Well, what's an example? Like, what's some shit they be saying in Jacksonville? Or don't be saying it in Miami or um, Tampa. It's really the accent. We all say uh, really? the whole Florida say the same shit, it's just the accent. Like Miami got a different accent. Yeah. So you, you could tell by like, how someone talks, you could tell if they're from Miami or they're yeah, from yeah, Tampa. Yeah. Or, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 And how someone raps too, is it the same shit? Like you hear someone rapping, you could tell how they rap, they're from oh he's from Tampa or he's from Kind of, kind of. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. How'd you get into making music? I, I, I actually got into making music to my homeboy. My, my brother and them, they used to he rap. Like, all of them started rapping before me. So I just yeah, ended up rapping with them. All right. What was the moment? Because I looked you up to it. It looks like you got cool. You got good numbers. You're doing, you're doing good right now. What was the moment that... Was there a moment that like put you on the map? Really, like got you going? Yeah, I got it. Um, I had dropped a snippet. When I was on house I was like... I was like... I really wasn't taking it serious. I was on house arrest type shit. Dropped a snippet that bit. Went viral that bit. Did like a million views. Yeah. Everybody just started hitting me. Like they begging for the song type shit. Really? Yeah. Everybody like all type of people hitting me. What'd you do after that then? To keep it going? Keep the ball rolling? I just started recording more music. And I just got the video. As soon as I got off the I shot the, I shot the video while I was still on house arrest. I dropped it. When I got off house arrest, it started going up. And yeah, yeah, all right. So after that, so now you're up. What did you do to keep the one steady, keep the momentum going after that? You kept dropping videos, or you just had to keep dropping? The situation I was in, I couldn't really shoot too many videos. So, uh, now I'm able to drop multiple videos back to back. I just dropped two videos back to back. Actually. Okay. I'm gonna keep dropping back to back. Um, yeah, all right. I'm leading up. I'm gonna drop the tape soon. For everybody that been begging for music on my page. All right. So, what's the biggest mistake you'd see? You say that you see other artists making that they kind of fuck up on. That's holding them back. I really pay attention to myself. But I be focused on perfecting my craft. But something that I do know, that I, that I pay game. Like, if you don't listen to your fans, your fans is a part of you, so you gotta listen to your fans. If you don't listen to your fans, you ain't gonna fame me. Yeah. You gotta listen to your fans, your supporters. What do you mean by that? Like, you're talking about, like if you get fan love, feed into it type yeah, shit? Yeah, yeah. Show your fans love. Yeah. Well, what's the biggest fan experience that you dealt with where you were like, oh, this shit's serious? You have people coming up to you type shit? Yeah, right. I say recently, I had went to the airport recently. I don't, I don't come outside. My first time coming back outside, like the other day, I came outside. I went to the airport. Like five people came up to me in the airport oh, really? asked for a picture. This is oh, my yeah. city. I'm okay. like, yeah, I'm doing something right. Yeah. What's the, what's the most people you performed in front of ever? Um, in Texas. I, was, I did it. Oh, really? Show. I did it. Uh, South by West. In Texas. Okay. Man, in Texas. But what, what city do you say you go to? You feel like you get the most love at in terms of fans where people recognize you and fuck with your music and shit? Uh, so far, it's out of Atlanta and and out here in LA. It's like, yeah, I fuck really? LA hard as fuck. Well, why do you feel like that is? Why do you feel like your shit rose to the top? Because it's a lot of people trying to make it. Why do you feel like your shit went up? I mean, I ain't making it. I'm still grinding, hey. bro, but shit. You're doing better than a lot of people. Yeah, so yeah, 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 yeah
appreciate that, man. Uh, that's it. Oh, yeah. It's good. So, I got with you. Oh, yeah. yeah, me locking in with my fans. Like, I started locking in with them, listening to my manager. My brothers, me and my brothers, we talk. Like, my brothers rap too, so we, you feel me? We talking. Like, we, okay. And then, yeah, so one last thing, too. What? Studio. In terms of, like, the Florida rap scene, because out here in Cali, we don't be known too much about, like, what's going on in Florida. But do y'all have, like, a good media presence? Is there a hell of bloggers out there? Or, like, is it easy to come up type shit? What's your perspective on it, just coming out of the local, locally out of Florida? We got, we got, a, few, we got a few blog pages out here. We got a few. Uh, yeah. Okay. We got 954. Oh. Yeah, I know 954. Yes. Yeah, Florida up next. Hey, shout out Florida up next. They damn near copy my. St I ain't gonna lie, cause I was I made NorCal next up, and then Florida up next came out like uh, like a year later. But they went up. They went stupid. I fuck with them though. I fuck with them. Yeah, cause they made their Florida up next. I'm like, damn, I'm NorCal next up. Like, but yeah, no, nah, shout out Florida up next. Though it's all love. You got four two cent. Yeah, yeah. four two cent for sure. Yeah, four two cent. Yeah, I fuck with them hard. That's the question. Yeah. All right. So don't, uh, yeah. Mm. Yeah. But do you feel like it just Florida got that mentality where people kind of be like, oh, it's impossible to come up in this city because everyone be hating type shit? Or is it like a lot of love and easy to network with? Uh, it's just certain parts. You just gotta, it's certain parts. But like, every part of Florida is different. So you yeah. can't really put an air on a certain thing. Oh, Florida. Yeah. All right. You want to let the people know what you got coming, what you got coming next? Where can we find you on YouTube, etc.? Find me on YouTube at Baby Boy. You gonna have to it's gonna see a bully game nation soon. There's a profile picture, Baby Boy. Type in one of my songs, that's going viral right now, it's going up right now. It's called Bands Up, Baby Boy Bands Up. That's my recent drop. I just got another song called The Mar. And I got a song called Gen 4 on the way with my big brother Dirty Rock. It's coming out in like two weeks. All right, y'all stay tuned, man. We out here, we bridging the gap, man, from Florida to NorCal to L.A. to SoCal. Fuck it.